Hello everybody, this is Etho, and welcome back guys to another episode on the Cracked Pack server. Woohoo! We're good. <laughs> Wasn't sure. Alright, uh, so guys, I introduced the arena idea last episode. Let's go, let's go take a look underground. Wait, where do we want to go? This isn't the spot. Let's go here. Yeah, right here is good. Go all the way down. Woohoo! So I'm just starting to clear out the space. And I wanted to show you the lasers because the lasers are so cool. <laughs> uh, I got tons of tons more of these module things. We got 64 speed modules in here, all sorts of translation and scale modules. Uh, can get rid of lava and water with this one. Um, this one just makes sure it hollows out the whole area instead of just like an outline. This one picks stuff up, and this one's the one that destroys blocks, and it's actually putting them in this chest here, although it's uh, it's filled up since I've been down here. So check this out. Ha 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 ha. <laughs> it takes it away pretty quick with 64 speed modules in, and it can keep up no problem too. Uh, when the chest gets full though, just like, it goes bleh, bleh, <laughs> just shoots the blocks out of the top, because it's got nowhere to put them. Um, so many bats. So I haven't decided what we're doing down here exactly. I have to figure some things out. One thing I know for sure though, is I want to be able to use missiles and grenades and stuff in our arena. It's going to be a deathmatch sort of thing. Nothing too complicated. I want to get it done quickly. And that means stuff is going to be destructible. So we have a couple options. We could try to... Uh, here, let's get our, our wand back. We can try to ward everything. Like if I ward blocks with this, they become indestructible. So that is one way we could do it. The issue with that though or one of the issues, first off, I've been using a lot of these uh, connected texture blocks with the, with the chisel mod. So you see how this, uh, like it has a, these sharp lines on the edges when it's alone, but when it's together, it sort of connects together. If you ward this, it kind of loses extra information about the block. Oh, it actually, okay, never mind. <laughs> it, it still joins together. Well, how about that? It's just the the non-worded ones and the worded ones don't go nicely together. I thought I thought it was going to leave these borders at every block, but I guess not. Okay, never mind. <laughs> not a concern anymore. Um, there is one issue though. I would love to be able to use those carpenter blocks, like the slants and all the different shapes you can do with the uh, all the slopes and stuff. What? whatever. <laughs> uh, I don't know if I can ward those. Um, we will have to experiment. Uh, we can check it out here. I had to stop by the tunnels. Uh, let's see if we can ward the carpenter blocks. Not on its own with a block. No. No, they're special. They're very, very special. So we may have to design the thing without using these. Oh, isn't this thing just so cool? Like, <laughs> I, I find I just want to stare and watch it. It's... It, oh, hey! How's it going there? Yeah, it's just fun to watch it do its do its thing here. Um, Just about done. One thing I find with this sponge module, though, it does clear away lava, but if it can't reach it all, or if it doesn't get the source blocked, it will... Uh, constantly make water flows and stuff, which I don't really think is a good thing. Like there's another one up here. Like it takes away the water stream, but it doesn't get rid of the source block. So it just, <laughs> it's like a never ending water pouring. Okay guys, so I've been working at this thing for a while and there's been some progress. Let me show you what's going on. Uh, I'm doing the same thing I did when I made my first building on the server. I'm just building the entire thing out of stone, pretty much, just to get the shape and and that figured out. And then I'm going to add the details later. 
uh, and fine-tune things but basically this is currently what we have I'm just building one half of the arena just on this one side and then I'm gonna look at all these mobs man <laughs> I, I've i sealed up so many caves, too, and they, they're yeah. still coming in. They, they like, fall from the ceiling randomly all over the place. And I've, as you can see, I've died twice while building. Well, I didn't have to tell you I died twice. I did die twice. <laughs> uh, you only knew I died once when you saw that. But, yeah, angry zombies. Two hit killed me twice in a row. These guys, the red-eyed ones. Look at this. What's going on? Oh man, there's more. And they're on their way. <laughs> Stop, I'm trying to record. Leave me alone. Alright. So, uh, this is just like the rough floor plan for things. A rough layout idea. I'm not spending, like I said, a ton of time on this. I just want to get it done quickly so we can have a fun little arena to play around in. Um, but uh, I kind of like how it's going. We got, so, so yeah, let me, let me just go through things with you. There'll probably be windows here and on this side, and then you, this is a spawn. Did I say that? <laughs> so you come out of spawn and you have three, three places you can go. You can go to the left, you can go straight, or you can go to the right. On the right here, it's probably going to be a pretty big building-ish type of thing in this corner. Um, and there'll be a way to get to the second layer here. The second layer will kind of go around the top. This cuts through the middle. There'll be a walkway that goes all across here. And there's going to be another big building here, hopefully. Kind of like taking up that much space and pretty much to the top of the, the arena. Um, I tried to do it in such a way that there's a decent amount of cover. Uh, you don't want a wide open map because then you can just shoot each other from <laughs> across the map and there's not a lot of challenge. So I'm trying to incorporate little obstacles that I have no idea what they're going to be when I add the detail. But right now they're just blocks where I feel we need them. There's like a little bit of cover here, a little bit of cover here. Um, and we are going to mirror it now or attempt to mirror it. So let me get the custom. Oh, here comes the mobs again. Let's get this thing. I think you shift right click to clear it. No, that's not what you do. You put in the crafting thing. All right. And I got these glass blocks in my corners. Uh, so shift right click to set one point. Shift right click in the opposite over here. All right. And then save it. Oh, man, these mobs. Uh, we're going to put it into our our thing here. Let me set this up, up off camera because it might take me a little bit. Oh no, we have a problem. We have a big problem. <laughs> Turns out I can't mirror this thing. Or at least I don't know how to. Ouch. Uh, yeah, I wanted to mirror this side onto the other side, but it, we can only rotate it using these rotation modules. There's no mirror module as far as I'm aware. Um, can't think of any way of mirroring it, so we may have to change our arena plans here. But this is what it does if we rotate it. Um, so that is, this would be the opposite team spawn right across. Um, but instead of like, for example, this walkway here just continuing on, on the opposite side, uh, that walkway over there is over here. Here, <laughs> I would have preferred if it mirrored, but we may be able to make this work. the The arena won't be as uh, interesting, though, doing it this way, in my opinion. But uh, I will try it out. So, what do we want to do? We want to. Uh oh, <laughs> did I get these? Yes, I can. Excellent. We want the field stabilizer. Anything else? Anything else? Uh, that might be it, actually. Or wait. I will try it. I think we might need something else, though. Didn't we need uh, this one? Oh, no. Okay. Oh, yeah, it's building it already. Cool. <laughs> I'd even... I just had a couple blocks in there. 
gonna run out pretty quick though. So that's gonna build the arena uh, rotated 90 degrees from the center points that I've made over here. Um, and that is just cool. <laughs> it ran out of blocks though. Uh, I finally made. Oh, oh, it's can't keep up on power either. Let's shut that off for a second. Today I finally made some of these deep storage units, which are awesome. You can store so much stuff in these. So I put some stone in here because I figured we'd need it here today. Um. Oh, what am I doing? No, <laughs> not there. In here. Um. Okay, let's turn it on again. I'll have to keep feeding it, I guess. Very cool, though. I like it. Uh, we'll we'll let this thing finish, and then we'll just see what it looks like. You know what? It's not too bad, actually. I thought it was going to be worse. It's it's not bad. We'll have to do some adjustments, of course, because like <laughs> from from our spawn, we can look into the other spawn and just shoot straight from here. That would be terrible. So we'll need things running across into the middle, for example, but a little adjustments here and there, and this should be pretty cool. Uh, so let's run through, like for example, this needs to go. <laughs> um, we may actually need to move this arena somewhere else. Y you, you might be noticing this right now. When I cross uh, like negative 40, I generally get a giant leg spike right there <laughs> every single time uh, um, unless I'm already here but if I if I go a chunk away and then go back it's loading something at our base that is causing a huge amount of lag right when it loads uh, which you know it's not a big deal when you're at the base but when you're running back and forth between this line it's gonna get annoying <laughs> these oh my goodness do you see all these bats so we may need to relocate this somewhere far away from either of the bases. So many bats! <laughs> I can't even hear them squeak. This is a, it's a very effective weapon, but if, if you can't hear them squeak, what's the point? Oh. Um, let me show you this too. I said it rotates 90 it's rotated 90 degrees. It's 180, but I used 90 of these, so it's it's doing a 90 degree rotation <laughs> based on however this works. Um, it's really cool though if you don't do a full like right turn. Oh no 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 no! Oh, off! Oh man! <laughs> oh, I forgot to take the stabilizer out. I just built a whole bunch of blocks I did not want in the arena. That's terrible. Oh, you have to be so careful with this stuff. But yeah, this is pretty cool. Check this out. It tries to approximate where the block should be based on the rotation. Um, so we can do diagonals and, and stuff with whatever uh, plan you give it, which is really, really cool. Ah, oh, now I gotta figure out how to clean up that mess I just made. <laughs> we got, we got silver blocks all over the place now. What, what's that about? Okay, so I fixed most of the mess I made on on this side, the main side, <laughs> but uh, the other side got hit way worse. The majority of the force field was on this side. Um, so I'm gonna probably destroy everything here using a force field. <laughs> and recopy this and mirror, or rotate it again and rebuild it uh, just so it's done properly. This force field saving so much time. No. <laughs> oh, that was such a bad mistake. Uh, I had a fun idea here, guys, though. Let's, let's try this out. So, gameplay-wise, in the arena, I thought it would be cool if we had a pretty powerful thing in the middle for people to fight over. Uh, so we're going to put a rail gun here and just see if this works. Hopefully this is enough power. Let's turn that on. Turret platform. Rail guns are f very fun. By the way, if you've never seen them, they are awesome. Um, get it on. 
All right. <laughs> And we need ammo for it. The thing about them, though, the ammo is extremely expensive. Uh, it takes diamonds. Each diamond's worth two. <laughs> oh, man. Alright, let's put it in the platform. Is it getting powered? Yeah, it's getting powered. That's good. So we got 12 shots here. And since we're clearing the side, I may as well shoot at some of the land and just see what it does. But, uh... Rail guns you can mount and aim at at your targets. Oh, I think I need a uh, wait a sec. I think we need a redstone signal too. Um, so I'm thinking we will have like some air pro propulsion that shoots people up into the middle. You get a really powerful rail gun if you get get into the middle, but you're also very exposed because you're at the center of the map and everybody's going to shoot you if they see you on the railgun. <laughs> so it's a nice trade-off, I would say. Um, let's just make a lever, I guess. Hopefully this will work. Do, 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 do. All right, and we will put it... Can we put it on it? Oh, does it go on its own? <laughs> oh, man. This thing is awesome. Okay, let's not shoot the wrong side, though. I just shot the wrong side. Are you kidding me? Yeah, I shot the wrong side. This does more damage than I thought, actually. <laughs> this is not going well. This is the good side. Ah... Let's turn it to the bad side. It's facing the bad side. Wait, is it? Yeah, that's the bad side right here. Oh, come on! <laughs> oh, no. It's still running. It's still running. Oh, no. I've got a bad feeling about this. I don't think the lever got blown off. Ah, uh, <laughs> okay, maybe, maybe no railgun. The railgun's fun and everything. It's just a little bit powerful. Um, just a little bit overpowered. Ah, oh, man. All right, I brought the water this time. Ah. <laughs> uh, I'm very sad about this. This could be... Th well, let's just see what it is. I I'm not going to start crying until we see how bad it is. Alright. Oh, is that... Oh, one of the chests blew up. Okay. Okay. <laughs> oh, there's my grave. Okay, so far not so... Not too bad. I would have been sad if all this stuff despawned, because it's, like this stuff, so many diamonds. Just an insane amount of diamonds. Uh, looks like it shut itself off. Yeah, I think the lever got blown up. Okay, let's get our grave. Well, that was fun. That was, that was good. <laughs> we will have to think of something a little less destructive, possibly. Or not install this until we ward everything. It's not going to let me get it, is it? Oh, come on! Okay, I can... You can break this stuff pretty quick, actually. Yeah, there we go. Alright, we got our gear back. All is good in the world. Don't worry, guys. <laughs> Alright, so maybe we'll finish up the episode with things that don't kill me. <laughs> I've died, I think I've died six times today, uh, which is just crazy. I haven't died in weeks on the server, and today is just like the worst thing ever. I think there's a way, was it, was it just this? No. There was, oh, maybe this. Yeah, there it is, okay. <laughs> there's actually a way to check the deaths. I'm in seventh. Pyro's in first. 44 deaths, Anders 40, Arcus 34. Why is... Oh, I just have top three get a different color. 
<laughs> Congrats, <laughs> Pyro. <laughs> Do in chat. <laughs> I built this thing, guys. This is uh, I've I've had trouble with not having machines around, and I just threw a couple furnaces here that are automated. I can drop stuff in this top chest, and <laughs> oh, he sees it now. And uh, like if I need charcoal or something, I just grab some of the the wood these guys are making for me. Or the big thing I've had trouble with. Oh, let me up here. Is uh producing steel. Steel has been a real pain to get on the server. Uh, now it's it's quite a bit easier thanks to this because I just drop off the wood, makes charcoal, and to make steel you just need two stacks of charcoal, one stack of iron, and you get steel right away. Well, you get that and then you gotta heat that up in a furnace too. <laughs> so you just drop it off again. I uh, got a metallurgic infuser here. This is to make uh, the computer chips, these things here, the control circuits. And this thing is another thing I've really wanted. This makes the missile modules and I can make missiles pretty easy now. It mostly just takes steel. Steel and a little bit of redstone. Um, if we go upstairs to the missile room, I upgraded that and it's it's working pretty good actually. Hey Sethbot. Yeah, so these are the tier 3 missile launchers. We have uh, stabilizer things in the back so they're really accurate now. And <laughs> look at the size of this one. It's it's insane. I think I think it's above the door. Oh no, it's just a little bit short. I planned this out perfect, guys. Look at this. I knew I knew it would just fit the tallest missiles. Um Let's see. I've tried launching a few of these at the enemies. You know what I found though is it takes like two minutes or three minutes sometimes for it to actually get where get to their side it takes a really long time and usually they've moved by the time it gets there so it's only so so effective you I, I have to like plan to do a scatter shower lots of missiles all at once I think for it to be really effective um, this is new here BTC is working on this it's like a tinkers construct smeltery place uh, pretty early in the works but he's got like all the ingredients you need for Tinker's Construct here and he actually gave me a mission uh, he asked if somebody could get him some Thomium ingots so I think I'll do that today <gasps> oh look at oh he's got like other tools here too oh man I actually need one of these <laughs> yeah. oh Oh snap. Alright, I think I'm gonna borrow one. I don't think you'll mind. I think this is for people to use. Um, this lets you place torches from a distance, like if you have them in your inventory. Uh, which I don't have any. That's pretty cool. So yeah, I'm gonna get them some Thomium ingots. Um, but that that's probably gonna be it for today's episode. I have some clips of some plane fun <laughs> we had the other day. We had we did a little dog fight. Uh, and we had some fun trying to get out of the hangar here and learning how to fly. Still didn't get my pilot's license, believe it or not. I tried so hard, but Arcus, he's hes really stingy. I have to impress him. <laughs> and then he'll give me my pilot's license. But we had a pretty fun uh, little fight. So that's going to do it for today, guys. I hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you again in the next one. Bye-bye. Once, um... When, once you like in mouse mode, you just uh, steer with that. It's way easier. Okay. Let's, let's see for that. Okay. Steer your mouse downwards right. to go up. Oh, this is amazing. You want to go? Oh, uh, who's going? I'll, I'll oh go. God. Oh, God. oh God! Oh man! Oh God! 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 Oh
Someone flipped my hanger. Words. I don't oh. know. Perfect where take you, off. Where did you go? I'm above. I'm above. Uh -huh. Other way. Kind of. Dude, I'm what is wrong? Me. Oh, there we go. I'm not quite sure. Oh, oh, oh. Okay, space is up. Oh, no. how, how do I? How do I go? Go down. Press C and press C. Use your mouse. Oh. Oh, jeez. Okay. Okay. Yeah, I got it. I got it now. Oh, there's there's a plane floating oh, oh, here. Okay. I guess it's yours, Anders. Yeah, should we okay. shoot at him or no? Oh, jeez. Oh no. <laughs> we, we should we should uh, get it. Cause he's gonna wreck the place. Yeah. Uh, ridiculous. Is this the oh. shooting man I'm telling you? Oh God! You Stop crashing me on purpose. <laughs> <laughs> you want me to pick it up? <laughs> yeah. Um. Wow. Be careful though. This is not a safe place to land. Oh, I'm a top tier how man. Do you, how do you land? <laughs> Look at there this. are spikes there, Evo. There are crazy sticks there. Crazy sticks. Is there? No. Oh. Well, close to. It. Close to. Turn your mouse upside down. Oh, jeez. <laughs> upside down. <laughs> where, where, where did you go, Seth? <laughs> I'm. I don't know. Oh, I'm coming back towards you. I think. Okay. <laughs> All right. Now I'm gonna try to make over here. Oh, oh my God. It's, it's All right, we going again? To the side. Okay. Yeah. I'll, I'll go. Okay, I'll go first now. Oh god, oh god, okay. oh god, F F5 mode was not good! F5 was not good! Okay, oh, no, don't do F5! Oh, oh no! <laughs> oh, no. Oh, oh, again. Oh, oh, god. Oh, god. Alright, oh, I got it this time. These planes take off so oh, slow compared to, <laughs> to mine. Stealing Argus! <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh! Oh, you cleared it. Nice. I made it. I made it. Nice. Okay, let's try. I'm just gonna launch oh. a plane from the surface when I get in again, and then we can try to have our. Are we behind me? Are we? Oh, we're doing this. I guess we're doing it. <laughs> oh, we're no! I'm coming, Zeb. Oh, jeez. Oh, 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 <laughs> oh, no, Your wing mate is coming. Don't worry, man. Oh no. Yeah, oh, no, 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 oh god. My engine stalled. Oh, jeez. <laughs> oh god. <laughs> oh, I don't want to see what oh. happens. Damn it. Oh, God. This is the greatest thing ever, Anders, and you're missing it. Stop on that! Yeah, man. <laughs> Holy crap. Stop it, you know. Stop saying that. I want to do I got a bogey in my sight! Stupid guys. Oh, no! <laughs> oh, man. Hard no. I was doing this. We've been in the one hour and 15 minutes. That's how long it took to, to do the Amarulos Stop. and the place. <laughs> wow. We are oh, so in the unefficient. <laughs> Come on, Severus, do me proud, bro. Oh, oh no, just kill him. Oh, 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 Arcus! Oh no, oh no! Kill him all. Oh no! Oh! Did oh, I, hit the, I don't even know if I hit the ground! <laughs> oh, I can already hear the planes. Ooh. Ooh, there we go, okay. Uh, plane? Okay, I'm gonna check my options again, just a quickie. I'm making a ditch okay, with okay. my wing, I think, but I think I'm good now. I think I'm good now. I lost you guys. Oh, I'm oh. Okay. oh there oh, you yeah. are. Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, I see you. So you come here, Etho. Oh, come here. Oh, 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 man. That hurt. That hurt. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, oh, God. There's someone. No snap. Ah. Whoa. Oh, there's the ground. Oh, there's the ground. Oh, 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 man. I see you, I see you. Come back here, man. No, no. Barrel roll. I'm going to get you. I'm going to get you. Oh, <laughs> Do it, man. Barrel roll. roll. The ground is getting closer. Oh, 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 there you are, there you are. Oh, you caught out to me. Oh, no, oh, no, oh, no, oh, no, oh, no. Why is it so hard to hit people? God damn it. Oh, 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 fire, fire. Okay. He's behind you, man. He's right on you. Uh, I, I'm what are you doing? I totally didn't crash. I totally did not crash. Uh oh. Down. Totally not lifting again. Tended bounce plane. off the ground through the water. <laughs> 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 oh no! Uh, Arcus, no! Well, thank you for subscribing, L. I'm stuck in a roll. Arcus, how good, man? Welcome to the Bullers family. Give him or her a warm welcome. I'm sorry, guys. I'm smoking a little bit, but I'm okay. Thanks. Oh god. Oh.